Karate literally translated means empty hand, and it is derived from a martial art developed in Okinawa, Japan, in the early 17th century just after the Japanese conquered this island and banned the use of all weapons. In national and international competitions, kata performance judgment is essentially based on assessing the following, technique, rhythm, power, expressiveness of movement and kind. Athletes have to perform several high-intensity actions during the match. Top-level athletes have high fitness levels and, according to a study, karate fighting is considered a high-intensity event. Anthropometric characteristics Body composition In the table, the percentage of body fat of top-level karatekas of different nationalities is presented. Karatekas weight categories range from less than 60 kg to greater than 84 kg for male and from less than 50 kg to greater than 68 kg for female athletes. It is desirable that athletes have a small percentage of body fat. Somatotype The table summarizes studies dealing with the somatotype of practitioners. In general, top-level male athletes have high rates of mesomorphic ectomorphic characteristics and less endomorphic characteristics. Bone mineral density A study revealed that practitioners had a higher bone mineral density than age-matched untrained individuals. More recently, another study revealed significant differences in bone mineral density assessed by a quantitative ultrasound method that compared athletes with control subjects. These authors suggested that it is a sport with a positive influence on skeletal status with the most significant benefits occurring in adults. Physiological Profile Aerobic Profile One of the most important factors governing an athlete's performance is their level of cardiorespiratory endurance. Cardiorespiratory endurance involves the ability to sustain prolonged exercise involving both the cardiovascular and respiratory systems. The body's demand for oxygen during strenuous activity is dependent on the efficiency as well as the ability of these systems to work together. Maximum oxygen uptake is considered a key determinant of an individual's current level of cardiorespiratory fitness. VO2 max is widely used by researchers to indicate an athlete's level of cardiovascular functional capacity. It is defined as the largest amount of oxygen that an individual can utilize during an exercise of increasing intensity. It has been reported that the V02 max of national and international male practitioners ranges, and for females. The disparities in findings may reflect differences in the mode of exercise testing. Anaerobic profile. A formal karate competition should consist of three minutes of fighting for male senior athletes or two minutes for each female senior, female or male junior and female or male cadet divisions. The duration of the longest series of offensive and or defensive combination techniques during a three-minute bout of sparring was 1-8 seconds, with the mean total accumulated time of performing the offensive and defensive techniques during the three minutes of sparring lasting approximately 19 for seconds. Thus, karatekas decisive actions depend mainly on anaerobic energy pathways. There is no specific test protocol for assessing the anaerobic fitness level. The Wingate Anaerobic Power Test is a widely used and accepted protocol for assessing anaerobic power characteristics. The 30-second cycle ergometer protocol requires a maximal effort by the subject against a resistance based on body mass. The results of this test provide data including peak, mean power output and percentage of fatigue over the 30-second period. The Wingate anaerobic test has been used by one study to assess the anaerobic profile of athletes. Physical Profile Muscle Power Reaching the highest performance level in karate is possible by applying high kinetic energy to one body segment over a short amount of time. Thus, muscle explosive power plays a major role in achieving top karate performances. Greater muscular power, specifically in terms of vertical jump performance, has been reported in a study when compared with their national level counterparts. Maximal dynamic strength. The most traditional way to assess dynamic strength is to determine how much an individual can lift for one repetition maximum. In consideration of dynamic strength, limited research has been reported for karate practitioners, table 6. 
maximal absolute bench press and half squat one repetition maximum differed significantly between highly competitive and novice athletes, which led the authors to suggest that the bench press and half squat are indicative of top-level competitive karatekas. However, a further study comparing winning and losing karatekas revealed similar one-repetition maximum performance for bench press and squat exercises.